Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. It's your one and only Lady Jackson bringing you this particular update as the AJ Heart. Now, for the highlight of the week, the housemates had their Saturday night rave, Saturday night party, as we probably know, and it was massively good. Initially, there was a lot of things that happened. Housemates disrespected Big Brother. He punished them a little, locked them, and then um, after the show, we got to see that um, Venita gave Big Brother the middle finger. She told him, fuck you. And um, we saw where Tolini Barge vowed that she was going to fight and beat up Libai and then leave the show. And then, of course, we saw where um, Sheyi was shouting because his drinks were stolen. And, of course, EK demanding that Big Brother should disqualify or give doing a strike now this and more you're going to get in this video so watch it till the end if you're new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe click on the bell button beside for notification and every post i make share comments down below and also share this video now let's get right into it so of course after the um saturday night rave right the housemates went into the house they were eating and drinking and everything and then it turns out she had had like almost 20 25 or even 50 so let me just see between 15 to 30 uh cans of guinness in a bag that he secluded now left to us the viewers we know that this is for a selfish interest and not to share with any other person aside maybe one or two persons in his clique of you know the um what do you call them the villains right so it turns out that somebody or some people had stolen and drink drank it until it was left only <laughs> It has left only one in the bag and he started shouting that you guys see now he saved these things and these people stole everything just remaining only one later they'll say he he's hiding and you know uh, hoarding stuff and that he's stealing stuff that's meant for everyone anyways people are going to get back what they saw and then of course ak joined in the conversation saying that people that should disqualify or or was it give, doing a strike because they were the ones who were locked in by big brother so like i said earlier Big Brother gave the housemates time and told them to rush into the party uh, zone. And then some housemates maybe didn't hear or didn't know. And then Big Brother locked them out of the party for almost 30 minutes, if I'm not mistaken. And then soon enough, Big Brother opened the door back and they got in. And that's how that went. And then during the the party we saw that Tolini Badge was dancing with white money having a good time and in my mind I'm like excuse me Tolini was it not you that was warning um what's his name Neil that you don't want to see him with any other girl in the house if you see you're going to cause chaos you're going to fight them and you don't want to be chaotic but you you're left with no choice and he was telling you to calm down that you know what he also sees you with other guys yet he does not Thing. and you are claiming that oh you don't want to see it in your face was it not in your face you were doing that girl mm? Mm? talking about the same Tony barge after the party we saw that they were just in the lounge people are not even undressed and she was shouting and raising her voice while she was giving you a stern warning that if that girl mentions his name if she hears his name one more time in her mouth or from her mouth he, she was going to beat her up she was going to get in a fight and she does not mind or care if she gets disqualified that she will fight on the show that she's going to give that girl a, a piece of her mind or a dose of her poison and in my mind i'm like excuse me excuse me madama are you not the one that in 2016 you posted that women should stop carrying men on their head they carry men matter for their head yet you embarrass yourself in your reunion well you are the same year we're shouting at each other and he was saying he doesn't want you and you said he, he you don't want him too and now you're fighting another lady because of him anyways it ain't none of my problem as long as y'all create content i will enjoy it talking about you know um faltering big brother's law and stuff and you know getting into uh fights first off 
um, I, I wouldn't necessarily call this a fight, but I support seeing that the drinks were almost finished. We saw a kid wire and cross were dragging over Guinness and it was a playful fight, but I was laughing and it was interesting. Moving on from that. And the last thing I'm going to say in this video probably is the fact that ah, this housemates are taking Big Brother for a joke like they're taking him for granted in many ways now we know that big brother needed to make more statements that was why he locked them out that was why he gave some stern warnings today to a few housemates who, who were you know having mic infringement warnings and stuff and every housemate have been noticing the little changes in big brother's attitude but no um just like uh, any other person who might have said something wrong to big brother for example, Samadina, Venita gave Big Brother the middle finger. So she was having a conversation with Adikili and in the pink room where they normally sleep. They were having random conversations and soon enough, that conversation moved from how the party was. Oh, Adikili now hinted on, ah, they can't lock us out this night. Ah, it's well low on Nawao. And then here was Venita saying that um, I almost just gave um, uh, the middle finger or give Big Brother the fuck you finger. Uh, but I'm just holding myself. I think you told her that, you know, don't do that. Nah, it's you don't you don't want to do that. And then here she was. She took her hand down to a cup of drink, picked the drinks, took a sip and then gave Big Brother a middle finger surprisingly it was as though the cameraman knew what she was going to do and then they took the camera to her and zoomed it she took it up and gave to me like at some point i'm like are these people actually reading and acting a script because this was so timely and so good like i cannot wait to see if big brother is going to punish her or not and of course this night we're expecting a lot more crazy chaotic everything that is going to happen now tomorrow is going to be the um fifth live eviction show now we know that the first live eviction there was no eviction but there's been three and this sunday will be the fifth and of course we'll be expecting a new uh set of jury members who are going to vote out one person and we hope that they do not make the same should i call it mistake or the same intentional um sense of favoritism that he did within the last two weeks because if they do that this time people are actually going to lobby and you know create a voting scheme that big brother should stop the jury voting because it is causing a lot of problems but anyways i'm going to bring you all the lowdown on everything that happens tomorrow so of course stick around while i bring you updates tonight and tomorrow